Hey yo, welcome on back on my Overloader and Plinko 2 friends. Uh, so, I'm going to be talking today about the hotfix update that we're getting uh, November 21st, 2024, uh, and updates to expect in December as well. So we got quite a few of those for December, so we're going to have a little bit of time on that. Um, and then also we're going to uh, talk a little bit on what I want to do with the channel um, and uh, other games that we'll be playing as well. But uh, before we do, I'd like to thank everyone who has subscribed. We're up to 102 subscribers already, so thank you so much. I am trying to get to 500 by the end of the year. So um, if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, share it out. Uh, greatly appreciate all the help that, uh, that you uh, can do. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the updates here. <clears throat> Excuse me. So the first hot uh, fix uh, to update, it's going to be on the guest uh, flume use. So the guests will, uh, whoop, let me go ahead and highlight this here for you. So the guests will uh, be less likely to change their minds on their way to, uh, to the use of a flume. So Estan uh, Wolf, I know he had issues with his slide um, or slides and um, it seemed as though people were going to the slide and then just before they got to the, to the gate, they changed their mind and turned around. So now uh, that should happen um, a lot less now. Um, and then uh, the chances that the guests will use the flume to enter the pool has been increased. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, the chances that guests will use flumes to enter a pool has been increased. Uh, and then we have... Uh, the weighting of flume prestige within guest decisions making has been increased. Uh, the chances of guests riding the same flume multiple times has been increased. And then uh, the guests will now find full pools less um, desirable. And then uh, the last two that we have is for the uh, guest queuing behavior. And the guests will now uh, to uh, the guests will now tolerate longer queues within reason, and will use more of the available queue path. And then um, the uh, queue times uh, being uh, reported by the the, the platform uh, within multiple slide uh, attractions will now display uh, correctly accurately. Yeah. So those are the updates that we are getting November 21st, uh, 2024. Uh, so I'm recording this on the 19th of November. It should be fully edited and uploaded by the uh, 20th. So it might be the evening of the 19th, but definitely by the 20th. So by the next day, it, it should be up for you guys and ladies. So now, what's coming into December? So December, we're getting quite a few. I'm not going to go through it all, uh, so you can always pause the screen and go ahead and just read it. I'm not going to go through everything because there's a, there is quite a bit, and I'm trying to make this video a little shorter here. Um, but uh, we do have uh, some uh, updates that are being worked on uh, and confirmed uh, for the UI. And uh, it does look like that they are making some changes for us PC players uh, because we have had quite a few issues for us when it comes to the UI system. Um, so we can use the uh, edge scrolling for the, the PC uh, browser tabs will remain open on, will remain on screen um, while in the tool menu. Um, and the, uh, let's see here, the color picker adjustments um and a whole lot more <laughs> let's see here do, 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 do. let's scroll down okay so where is it there was one thing i saw on here that i thought was really good oh yeah right here the pathing system here for the paths 
uh, they're going to be removing the Planet Coaster 2 logo from the paths, which is great because that, 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 that's just annoying, that, 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 the, the decal that's on it. Now, what I would actually like to see would, if, if they could keep at least that decal pattern, so that way if we want to add that onto a path, we can. Just don't make it mandatory like it, it was there where it was just on every single path. That was just annoying. Um, and so, uh, let's see here, uh, customer tracks and transport rides, um, what else do we have here? I haven't, I haven't really even gone through here. I just, I got to this point here and I was like, okay, let me go ahead and do this on the video here. Adding a new heat map for guest tolerance. Uh, which will show their tolerance of fear, nausea, and ride height, amongst other factors. Okay. Uh, scenery, add scenery pieces to create custom coaster supports. Hey, there we go. Very nice. Uh, adding a selection of grass pieces for players to use in their parks interesting uh weather yeah okay the weather is going to be um changeable in um in the sandbox mode sandbox mode what are we doing here increasing the possible maximum guest cap uh while playing in solo solo play in sandbox mode on pc only okay very nice very because i know i know a lot of people wanted a lot more than just the 6,000. Uh, let's see here. Increasing the number of items displayed in the browser per page for the workshop. Very nice. Uh, see, I'm still scrolling down here. <laughs> That's why I said pause it and read. Um, and now these ones here, the bold items, are like the newest ones. Uh, if you didn't read it up on the top there. Uh, but now the... Um, the janitors now empty bins in their staff zone. All right, so we got more of the flume work on here. So this is underneath uh, working on. So I would think since this is working on, this would be like ones that will definitely be getting in December or maybe the, the confirmed ones. Those ones are definitely confirmed for December. These ones are working on trying to get it in for December. If not, maybe then 2025. That's probably what it is. Um, but uh, they're, they're going to improve the flume physics uh, behavior, which is good. I know a lot of people have been upset with the uh, physics for the flumes. Um, to me personally, like I'm not really big into the knowledge of the physics for, for the slides and flume work and, and so forth. So um, it, it didn't really affect me as much but on the realism part i could definitely see that uh but i do like the fact that they are making these improvements so that way everyone can have fun with it um and it makes it more realistic too especially for uh for everyone who's trying to do the realism park aspect to it so that's great i like that um so many updates so many updates um uh, the ability to uh, reset, reset objects uh, back to their default color. So that's great. And then they're going to be, from the workshop, removing the download limit on the PC. So that's great too. That's really great. I like that. So, uh, as you can see, all the different updates that we're going to be getting for December and... Uh, and then what we're getting for November uh, 21st here. So I'm I'm really great that I'm really happy and grateful that uh, that um, uh, everyone over at the frontier, the devs there, have been listening to to the player base and um, have really you know tried to improve. I will say I wish the game came like this already, fully improved the way it should be at release uh when we paid the full price um you know because we're paying full price for a completed game you know not partially completed but the fact though that they are 
uh, working hard to to improve it. Um, does speak volumes at least like they, they are they are trying which i i really do appreciate um and that's what really that's what really matters that you know yes that they, they know it's not quite right but they are definitely working on it hard and they're trying to improve so that way the the player base is is happy with with the game so um so i, I do like that um, but yeah, so, so for the channel, uh, I know I've been, uh, I haven't posted quite a bit here or done anything live. I am hoping to actually do a live show tomorrow, the, uh, 20th, uh, where we'll be doing the franchise mode. Um, but, uh, for the last week I have been, uh, just sick in bed, um, unable to get out of bed. Uh, so... Uh, that's why the whole uploading and everything just stopped. I haven't even really been able to play that much. So I'm just now really getting fully back into it again. So um, I want to thank everyone, though, who has still been engaging in the videos while I've been out. Thank you so much. I, I really do appreciate it. And if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button, uh, subscribe, share the video, um, you know, uh, I'm trying to get to 500 subscribers before the end of the year, so it would be great if I could hit it. Um, but uh, what I want to do is uh, do more of the videos on here of Plinko 2, uh, establishing parks as well as um, uh, showing off parks as well, doing my own spotlights. Um, and so if you're interested in that and you want to submit that let me know in the comments below and i'll try and work out a way for for submitting your parks for spotlights um but um i would uh very much like to get that going as well if if you all are interested so make sure you comment that down below let me know um and then there's going to be other games though too that I'll be uh, playing on here as well. I do have the uh, TCG, uh, so if you uh, if you want to see that, I can also play that one as well on here. Um, and then um, I actually have quite a few. I was also thinking of getting the uh, two pine uh, uh, two two pine um, museum. Um, so, uh, uh, if, if you want to see that, I think that comes out in February, the launch for that. So let me know if, if you want to see that, comment that down below. Um, but, uh, those are just a couple of games there. I do have quite a few as well. I have a huge library, so I will be, uh, probably playing a few of those from time to time and uploading them up. Uh, but uh, the main game that I really want to try and focus on the most will be Planet Coaster 2. Um, but um, besides just that, that, that I'll have at least... I want to try and do at least two episodes of Planet Coaster 2 a week. And then two episodes of, of a different game. Just to help, you know, keep me sane and uh, keep me, you know, interested in... in uh, and uh, working forward in, in the videos and so forth. Uh, otherwise, if I just stick to just one game day after day after day, you know, eventually some some may get a little sick of it, and um, and I don't want that to happen with me. Uh, so that's what I'm going to try and do is keep it that way, so that way, you know, I, I, I give you guys all what you like, you know, give you all a little bit of something. Uh, but yeah, so I think that's pretty much it for, for this episode, though, today. Uh, I want to thank you all, though, again. Like I said, we're up to, as of this recording, 102 uh, subscribers, so that's great. I really appreciate it. Uh, it's been a big help. Uh, let's try and make that 500. Um, but thank you all again, and uh, thank you, and have a wonderful day, and I'll see you all next time in reality.